what we're going to be looking at then in this vid is what's called a photo cell kit and that basically comprises of a photo cell head uh, the socket into which it connects and the wall mount brackets all of that is contained in that box complete with fixing screws and a couple of little wee wall plugs as you can see I've already opened this box up extremely carefully and there it is okay so that part is the head a wall mount bracket with the sockets on the top I've got a screwdriver handy we'll get in there undo these two screws have that socket out of the wall mount bracket you need to do that anyway in order to wire it up should do something like that if it doesn't come out you can always plug the cell back on there lock it into position and then just pull it and then it there you go it comes out and you can release that like so cork seal okay it's got an interesting smell to it that is so there's your wall mount bracket then note that large hole underneath okay when they supply these you, uh, they don't supply some kind of ceiling gland in there to where the cable goes in that's for a number of reasons and that is mainly due to the fact that you can offer up a range of different cable management options to that one of them being a a 20 millimeter conduit adapter it will have basically a nut on on the inside if i can just get a nut so it'll look a bit like that uh, you put that down the inside like so in there something like that there we are and then on the outside you would have a threaded section which would go up in there and into that adapter you then put in 20 millimeter pvc conduit okay that's one option uh, the other option is basically a cable ceiling gland like this okay you put that in the bottom and uh, whiz that up if i can do it right okay i've got it in there there we are then so as you can see i've got a cable stuffing gland on the bottom of that now you can run a flex into that and uh, wire up the terminals respectively so i'm going to now reassemble this i'm going to take that stuffing gland off because it doesn't really belong on there i'll just put it on there for demonstration and it was a bit of a fiddle getting it on there wasn't it here we are then let's get that ceiling gland out of the way and as we, if we look underneath you can see there's not much space in there to uh, accommodate any what uh, excess wiring which is why i say if you are using a piece of three core and earth cable in there you might need to actually snip the earthing conductor off so there's our base once again with the socket in it got lined it up plug it in there and then to lock it you twist it okay and there you go that's what it would look like if that was fixed to a wall then just like that move that over that way a bit there we are so that is what it would look like if it was fixed to a wall nice and straight of course not skew with like that so there you are what we've been looking at then is a Zojon SS4D photo cell kit on Wayne's Electrical I'd like to say thanks for tuning in and watching